What's up YouTube, Saf here on Super Saf TV. We have a very, very special video for you guys today. This is the epic Nokia unboxing. And in this video, we have not one, not two, but three new devices to unbox. There's a Nokia 3, the Nokia 5, and the Nokia 6. So Nokia are well and truly back on the scene, and they have the aim of getting premium quality smartphones into the hands of everybody. And that's the reason why these devices are all coming in at very competitive prices. I'll be leaving a link below for the latest pricing and availability information. Now let's go ahead and get these unboxed. We'll start off with the Nokia 3. So if you're on a bit of a budget and you still wanna get the best value for your money, then the Nokia 3 is gonna be the one for you. And here is the device. And as well as the device itself in the box, you get your power adapter, a micro USB to USB cable, some headphones, product and safety info, getting started guide, as well as a SIM card ejector tool. And looking at the device itself, we'll get it outside of its plastic. Now the first thing you'll notice straight away with the Nokia 3 is that it actually looks really premium and that's because of the machined aluminium frame. You've got a polycarbonate back as well as Gorilla Glass on the front. Let's go ahead and switch it on. Love that sound. Now this premium build is actually quite impressive, especially considering the price point that this comes at. You've got a five inch IPS LCD 720p display here. And for the internals, you have an MTK6737 processor with two gigabytes of RAM, 16 gigabytes of storage on here with a micro SD card slot. So you will be able to expand the storage on here. This is always great to see. And a key thing about this as well as the other devices is that they come with a clutter-free 100% Android experience. You're not gonna have any heavy skin on here or anything like that. And that is also gonna mean quicker updates. So you're not gonna have to wait months and months for an update like you have to do with other devices. These are gonna be coming very quickly from Nokia. Now for the cameras, you have eight megapixels on both the front and back with an f2.0 aperture and an LED flash. And this device comes with a 2630 mAh battery, which should be plenty for you. So this is all at a very, very low price point. Very, very impressive. Now let's move on to the next in line and that is the Nokia 5. So think of this as the in-between of the Nokia 3 and the Nokia 6, costing a little bit more than the Nokia 3, but a little bit less than the Nokia 6. Once again in the box, you've got a power brick, USB to micro USB cable, headphones, some paperwork, as well as the SIM card ejector tool. But this time you have a seamless metal body. So it's got metal all around and this has been machined from a single piece of aluminium. Now the display is slightly larger compared to the Nokia 3. You've got 5.2 inches IPS LCD with a 720p resolution, but this has a massive 3000 mAh battery. And with that size battery and this resolution, it's gonna mean you're gonna be getting lots of usage out of your device and you're not gonna to have to charge it as often as many of the devices. Another thing that you notice is that the Nokia 5 comes with a fingerprint scanner right here on the home button at the front, so in a very accessible place. And this actually has the Snapdragon 430 processor with two gigabytes of RAM, 16 gigabytes of storage, which is also expandable. And with the latest version of Android available here on this, it's gonna be very, very smooth. Now for the cameras, you've got an eight megapixel front-facing camera with an f2.0 aperture. But for the rear-facing camera, you actually have 13 megapixels with an f2.0 aperture. And with the Nokia 5, you also have 2.5D sculpted Gorilla Glass, uh, which really nicely blends into that metal frame. So a very premium look and feel overall. Now, the final device in this collection is the daddy here. This is the Nokia 6, costing just a little bit more compared to the Nokia 5, but you're gonna be getting lots more features. Inside the box, once again, you've got a power brick, a micro USB to USB cable, some headphones, some paperwork, as well as the SIM card ejector tool. And let's go ahead and get this outside of the plastic. Now, straight away, I can tell you this feels really, really good in the hand. That is because of its aluminum build. It takes 55 minutes to machine this out of a solid block of metal. And that really does show on these chamfered edges, which look and feel absolutely great. Now up front, you've got a larger 5.5 inch display with a full HD resolution, which is also higher. And the Nokia 6 has dual speakers with Dolby Atmos. So you're gonna be getting a really nice immersive experience with this larger display under those speakers. So if you're somebody who consumes a lot of media or watches lots of videos on your smartphone, then this is gonna be absolutely great. Powering this is the Snapdragon 430 processor, but this time you have three gigabytes of RAM with 32 gigabytes of base storage, which you can expand with the micro SD card slot. 
There's a fingerprint scanner here at the front in the middle, so a very nice and accessible place. And all devices do also come with a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack, so you can use your preferred headphones if you'd like. You've got an eight megapixel front-facing camera with an f2.0 aperture, but one of the main features here is the camera on the rear, which is 16 megapixels with an f2.0 aperture, as well as a dual LED flash. There's a 3000 mAh battery, once again, with that super clean and clutter-free Android experience. Personally, I'm very, very impressed with the build of this. This looks and feels really, really premium. That's really impressive considering the price point that this comes at. This is still a third compared to many of the other high-end flagships out there. So guys, that is the epic Nokia unboxing. Here you can see all of the devices side by side, the Nokia 3, the Nokia 5, as well as the Nokia 6. If you're interested in picking one of these up, there will be a link in the description below. What do you guys think of these new Nokia devices? Definitely drop me a comment below, let me know your thoughts. I hope you enjoyed this video and found it useful. If you did, then please do hit that thumbs up button for me, it really does help me out. And if you haven't already, then be sure to subscribe and switch on notifications. There's plenty more content coming up on here. Thanks for watching and thanks to Nokia for sponsoring this video. This is Saf on SuperSaf TV and I'll see you next time.